It must be tough. No, never mind. Take this one. Huh? Um. Take it. Uh. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Right. Off we go. <sighs> and these right here are my babies. like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. That's the one I gave you. Huh. It is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Whoa, foxtails, huh? I gotta hand it to you. I never would have thought of that. It'll definitely take them by surprise. I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? cut out for this crap. Sure you are. And when you're done, you'll be drowning in job offers. So, how do you think they'll arrange these flowers? Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. out here oh okay but I might be a while why not check out the town Isn't this good? 
still at it. Is this right? This here's the Sector 5 Community Center. Someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. Isn't this good? Come on, I want to climb up there. No, it's much too dangerous. But I'm scared of the doggy. That's what's called easy money. We even got to be on TV. I understand you must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. Oh, hello. Cloud has been assisting me with my research and development. Ooh, that sounds fun. Count me in. One moment while I run diagnostics. Huh. How very strange. You don't appear to be in my database. And that's bad? There must have been some sort of server error. Oh well, any friend of Cloud's is sure to be of great help. the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I have the most amazing news. I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia, something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. Please let me know when you have made your preparations. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia.
then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator. Outstanding! The Shiva summoning materia is complete. And now it's yours. Use it as you see fit. The Lady of Frost is the perfect companion for a man like you, Cloud. She will prove most useful when the time comes to destroy Shinra. future battle intel submissions
since he heard about what happened. Just got in a big old ship in a fabric somewhere. I've got the finest collection of materia you'll find anywhere. No life. Oh, hey. you won't stop Come on. I know this place is off limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. You guys have gotta Pretty hurry flower. and find our friends, Pretty okay? Flower. They ran off this way. Be careful. Where do you think they went? Who knows? They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself. You're done. Go on. I got your number. Shatter. Yes. Get him. It's over. Let's go. Okay then. Stay back. And catch. Enough. That's bad. Go on. That's bad. Let's go. Leave this to me. 
I don't think so. Go on! Good night. One more shot! That's that. Quickly, we gotta save them. All right. I can fight too, you know.
be a soldier. I back you. Over. You can't just grow up to be a soldier. You gotta work at it. Cloud thinks I'm good enough to be one, right? Look at you, Mr. Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's really cool when you went like. Yeah. Yeah. You've got it all wrong. Like that. No way. It was way faster than that. Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Fine. Then how about. wrong nothing is tifa like your girlfriend no hmm, but she's someone special it's not like that more like i don't know how to explain i see Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Shh. Thanks for helping our friends. See me, be quiet. I'm keeping an eye out for monsters. Shh. Thanks for helping our friends. Damn similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come to think. <laughs> the reunion. <laughs> Nothing to fear. <laughs> Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. <sighs> then you must be from the legendary. Wait! Stop running the away legendary. from me! Hey, Cloud! I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry. I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Oh, 
my! Is that a Moogle? You can see me, Koopo? Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopo. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopo. Anyway, we've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But you'll need to buy a membership first. If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopo. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. I see you're working hard, Mr. Merc. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. There's a lot of problems we can't fix because we're just kids. And that's where you come in. Soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? <sighs> that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. One boy patrols near some concrete pipes. One girl likes to do her patrols in public areas with lots of people. One boy spends most of his time checking out the shops. 
One girl loves to be fussed over by folks at the community center. One boy likes to stand guard at the town gate. And don't forget, they all wear homemade swords on their backs. Thanks again for agreeing to help you guys. Great job. It's wonderful. <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. I don't know if you know it, but there's this awesome place. <laughs> I wonder if I can buy oh, this. There soon, my sweet little You can see the sky? On. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> <They're blue. laughs> very determined. These are dangerous times. The reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are gonna have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Ms. Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot! 